In this video, we're going to talk about a common error that you see in some of the corridors in high fill areas or high cut areas. Um, and what these are called is these are called bow ties. And what bow ties are is it's when you have a object inside of Civil 3D, specifically your corridor, coming around at a radius and they are crossing each other. So to display this, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to modify our profile for our design alignment. And then I'm going to show you what that bow tie looks like and how to clear it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this alignment or this profile. I'm going to grab the grip for the PVI and I'm going to bring it up to right around here. And when I do that, you'll notice that the corridor is now out of date and I need to rebuild it. So I'm going to rebuild that corridor. And when I rebuild it, you'll see that there's this issue happening where as this comes around the corner, these couple of corridor cross sections are actually going across and looping back on themselves. This is what a bow tie is. And so in order to clear a bow tie, what you need to do sometimes is you need to select your corridor and inside of the contextual ribbon bar for the corridor, you're going to go up into the corridor tools and click on the clear corridor bow ties button. And so when you do that, Civil 3D is going to prompt you to select a baseline. The baseline is the alignment for your corridor. So whatever you built your corridor off of, that's your baseline. We built this corridor off of our center line. So I'm going to go ahead and select the center line and Civil 3D is going to ask me to specify the starting sub entity. The starting sub entity of this bow tie is the tangent here. So I'm going to select the tangent and then the ending sub entity is the tangent here. It's hiding underneath some stuff. So I did a shift space click to cycle through. I'm cycling through until I see myself highlighting this tangent section inside of my alignment. I'm going to go ahead and select enter. And what's going to happen is now it's saying, where is that bow tie? So we're going to come to a location where we're trying to define where that bow tie is. And if I select this area here and I hit enter, what Civil 3D is going to do is it's going to wipe out that area and recreate the lines that create that corner and kind of clear up that bow tie. So now when I go ahead and select the corridor and I go and select the object viewer, when I look at that area, what you're going to see now is that you're going to see a better defined corner here where you have good grading around this corner instead of something that loops back on itself.